It's 11.40 in the morning. I wanted to make this video just to tell y'all how I'm doing, how I'm living. I know it's only been a month, but I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a month. I think it's been like a month and a couple days because it's the 26th. I graduated May 23rd, so it's been about a month and three days since I graduated. I think I'm going to do this one now, a month update, and then a year update of next year of life after graduating. Yeah, I've seen a couple videos like this, but the one that I've really seen recently was a boy Benji uh, video. i seen his, and I'm like... Let me make an update video, and I'm like, let me make an update video just to tell y'all how I'm doing, you know, like, life after high school, you feel me? It's, you know what I'm saying? Life after high school. It's only been a month, so it's nothing too crazy. And plus, I'm still in the summertime. Like, I'm still in the summertime effect. Like, it just feel like it's naturally summer, so I'm probably really gonna feel this shit once the next school year start. But as of right now, I have been good. Let me show y'all my hair. I ain't gonna lie. I've been rocking the Durag swag a lot lately. Now, I was gonna have it all the way on, but I'm like, I low-key wanna show y'all my full hair. I have not It's low-key. Not even low-key, it's like mad at like hell right now, but I got like the braids going on, feel me? This is my first video showing y'all like the hair and shit. I got like the color for rebel brands in, feel me? Else and shit, but it's this one dread that's always fucked up crazy. But hey, I've been rocking a Dewey swag, just having them out, right? Then I throw on a little, you know what I'm saying? Throw that, throw that motherfucker on. Yeah, I just been on this type of swag lately, you feel me? Obviously, I could be having a whole do rag on, but I don't feel like tying this motherfucker up, but it's been a swag lately, bruh. It's been a swag, you know what I'm saying? Some cool shit. Actually, I'm about to just put it all the way on for y'all real quick. So this shit, not no half ass shit. As I was saying, bro, the main thing, it doesn't really feel too crazy now being out of school just for the fact of it's only been a month and it's still summertime. Like, if it was this time last year, if I was like in Leverage or grade, it would just be the summertime for me. So I'm still, it, it just feels normal right now. But as I said before, I feel like once the next school year starts, that's when it really hits. But I'm still a graduated student, so primarily, I ain't gonna lie, how it feels now, like, it honestly doesn't feel too crazy graduating, just for the simple fact of, I kind of have a clear set plan of what I want to do. That's one thing I can say, like, if I didn't know what I wanted to do, I feel like it'd be a lot more challenging, but since I, priorly, before I even ever graduated, I've been doing content, I've been doing YouTube, Twitch, the clothing shit, the music, so, I always had a clear idea of what I wanted my dream jobs to be, so... I, what I can say is, if you're still in school, don't feel like you have to rush and find out what you want to do. Especially if you're a senior. I feel like a lot of niggas, even teachers, they tell you, yo, you got to find out what you want to do before it's too late. Um, Do this, do that. And obviously, be on your shit. Like, don't not be on your shit, but don't feel forced to do some shit that you don't want to do. I feel like that's the big thing I want to say. Because like I even said myself, the video that I graduated in. A lot of people going to school, bro, and I feel like I'm not saying don't go to school. You don't have to go to school if you don't want to go to school. Like, it's so many more outlets you can do, nigga. You can be an artist, content creator, a musician, etc. Like, on some creative, artistic field type shit. Like, don't feel forced to have to go to college. That's one thing I got to say, and I know everybody living situations is different. So, luckily enough, I have some parents that support what I do, and... My main set plans that I want to say here on out is just get a cool job because right now I don't have a job. So just get a cool job, staff from there, and just keep working on my content shit until that shit, like I can do that shit full time. And I know eventually it's going to come, but I'm just happy with the journey I got now because once I do get a cool enough job to where I can have enough time to focus on my content, music shit, whatever I want to focus on, and then just be able to stack on that certain job. Like I said, I have good enough parents to the point where I can do all of that, still get some support. A lot of this stuff is just on me, grinding. And that's another thing too. A lot of shit gonna be on you. Like once you hit like 18, I feel like once you hit 18 in general, a lot of shit gonna be on you. Like my mom literally told me like, all this shit is up to you now. You feel me? I don't say it's all up to me. Like they still gonna help me and shit. But like all like my big choices, like if I wanna get a job, nigga, that's on you. If you wanna do content, pursue it, that's on you. If I wanna go to, if I wanted to go to school, that's on you. Like, a lot of shit, it's, it's just, I got a lot more freedom now to do what I want to do. If that makes sense with my actual living circumstances of career-wise. Have a, I don't want to say have a steady set point on what you want to do, but be on the lookout of that. Like, don't not knock that. Because I'm not saying just waste all your school years doing some bullshit, going to parties, talking to friends. That shit cool for the moment, but in the long run, make sure you got a clear idea of what you want to do. Because I've seen videos of people making these prior 
I feel like a lot of people try to like downplay this shit. Obviously, graduating is a major accomplishment, but like people be talking about some like after school, it t life turns ass, life turns shit, bro. Life is whatever you make it. All that shit, I feel like is just projecting. Obviously, it might put a little bit more pressure on you because you you feel like you getting older, ain't gonna lie. Cause like after school, you done with school, you finish, you just finished twelve years of school. So I understand that aspect. Like nigga, it might be a little bit more pressure. You might feel a little bit more older, but bro. Life is literally what you make it. All that after high school life turns to shit. You gotta do this. You gotta like, bro, shut all that shit up. Life is whatever you want to make it. Don't let nobody change your perspective on how life is. Life is whatever you want it to be. All that goddamn life is ass. Life is shitty. Life is fucking great. I don't got everything in the world that I want right now. But at the end of the day, I know if I keep working on this shit, it's gonna be good. And that's all I can say after high school. You just gotta work on yourself completely. Just. Work on yourself, lock in on yourself, because at this point in age, we still young as shit. I'm assuming y'all probably like 17, 18, 19, graduating high school. We still young as hell, bro. Like, we still young. We still got our youth. We ain't even 20 yet. We ain't, you feel me? Like, we ain't even 21 yet, bro. Like, you still got some youth in you, bro. Don't feel like when you graduate high school, you old as shit. Like, I feel like the generation cut the society with the unk shit. Like, bro, I am not an unk. I'm still a young. I'm still a young nigga. So the young nigga look good, nigga. The young nigga look good. Don't let these old heads, these niggas on the internet, people on the internet tell you that once you hit a certain age, you lost your spark. Like, bro, life is whatever you want it to be. If you want to be an artist, be an artist. You want to be an astronaut, be an astronaut. You want to be a content creator, be a content creator. That's all it really is, bro. And if you're still in, like, 11th, 10th grade, 9th grade and you see this video, bro, you have, like, Peak youth. I'm not gonna lie, like being at that youth, it's start as early as you can to be on your shit, bro. Cause I feel like it's no real due date on when you can actually start locking in. But if you're, like I said, in those younger stages of school, like ninth, 10th grade, even 11th grade, bro, lock in on your shit. Cause I'm assuming you're just entering high school or some shit, you're adjusting, getting new to that shit. Don't be too focused on friends. Don't be too focused on parties, extra shit, gossiping, drama, like, bro, lock in on your shit. Don't try to force being friends with nobody. Focus on yourself, cause nine times out of ten, bro, the geek. This it, it's crazy how these stereotypes actually true as shit, bro. You are who you hang around with, bro. You are who you hang around with. If you want to be, a, if you a natural geek, hang with the geeks. If you want to be a jock nigga, hang with the jocks, etc. But this is another thing too that I want to say. After high school, bro, everything like all that clout, popularity, that shit's out the window, bro. You're a whole nother. You're just a whole other spectrum on earth. A whole nother little species. Another little ant. Eh, on earth which is a good thing because it's like now it's like you get like a little reset like you beat the child mode the minecraft now it's time for the story mode you feel me tight shit so you get to make a real name for yourself but don't think once you leave high school that little popularity you had in school transfers over bro this is the real world bro nobody's too focused on you if you ain't making a name for yourself nobody's gonna be focused on you and that's perfectly fine you gotta build your name up for yourself bro you can't go into the real world thinking nobody owes you anything like at all nobody owes you a dime a penny it's really all for focus on you, and that's a good thing to start out with. I know it can be scary, like I said, but you get a fresh start. A fresh start at life to do what you want to do, try some new shit out. You ain't got to worry about school no more. I was that type of dude. For instance, once school over, I'm going to do streaming full time. I'm, I won't have no distractions. I won't have no essays to do. I won't have to wake up the next day and worry about a 12-page assignment having to be done by 12 p.m. So that excuse, school shit excuse, is out the window. I have damn near every day, full time, to focus on my craft, which is content. I've been doing that. Being out of school, I've been more consistent with the streams, more focused on my actual craft instead of school. It's been good, bro. That's what I can say. It's been good. But just some simple shit I got to work on myself a little bit more, but bettering who I am and bettering my craft. But that's naturally. We're supposed to evolve every day. So as long as I'm getting better at least 0.1%, I'm fine with that. I don't want to talk your heads up too much. This is just a little update video. Give y'all some little tips and shit about what's going on after high school life. If you want to go to the, you know, prom and shit like that, you know, you know all the little dances and shit, you know what I'm saying? Enjoy y'all school years, bro, because that's another thing I, I ain't even mentioned too. This shit flashes like this, bro. Shit flashes like this. I remember being in sixth grade, bro. Sixth grade, bro. Sixth grade had to be one of the funniest years of my life. I ain't gonna lie. Like, that was one of them years, bro. Like, I met most of my friends I know now. Some friends you're gonna meet, you might know them forever. Some friends might know them for a week. Just enjoy this shit. Enjoy the school life and have fun with it. Don't try to rush this shit. I'm telling you, don't try to rush this shit. Like, it's strange how niggas used to, you know, all the people used to tell me, like, just enjoy being a kid and nothing like that. I'm still young, but, like, I ain't that kid, 11, 10, 12, 13, 14, so just enjoy it, man. Without further ado, if y'all got any ideas y'all want me to do, I got y'all. But, before I'm out, I'll let it, man. Keep going for me. I'm going for y'all. But, before I'm out, man, peace.